Hi everyone, it's Emilia here. In this video I'm going to show you how to make this uh, Famiran flower, which looks a little bit maybe like a cabbage for me, but I really like the shape. So to, to make it we will need something uh, sharp, like I've got barbecue stick, uh, stamens, rosy owl dies, and I'm going to use um, big die. It's not the biggest one in the set, but, but it's quite big. Uh, as well, you obviously need a foam, uh, iron and hot glue. And first of all, we have to die cut uh, flowers. And for, the, for our flower, we will need five layers. I obviously couldn't count properly because I did the four uh, first and the last one separately. But you can die cut five uh, layers of foam at the time at once. When we've got five uh, layers, we can turn on the iron and remember to turn off the steam. Iron on medium hot, not uh, like two dots, not very hot. And we place a petal on, on the iron and um, keep it on it for three, four seconds and then roll it uh, in your fingers. Or you can do like I did here on my hand. Just remember to press quite hard because you want uh, the foam to become smaller and thinner and feel a little bit uh, like a paper. When we've got that ready, we uh, take a stamen and we will start uh, shaping the flowers. So we have to open uh, each one and stretch each petal to the side. We try not to touch the top of it, like put your fingers in the middle and um, stretch to sides. Oh, and as you can see, some uh, breaks, but that's okay. Don't worry, just take that uh, petal of the flower and it's fine because for the first year, year, layer we won't be using um, all, uh, you know, all five petals, probably three or two only. You do repeat it with each layer and each petal the same uh, way, just stretch the sides and uh, we want this uh, petals be quite wide so for the first layer just add the glue around the stamen and try to um, place the petals a little bit above the stamen so it's, um, you know, like the stamen is uh, hiding a little bit inside. And as you can see, I used only three uh, petals for this layer and I think uh, it's, it's enough and you could uh, use probably two uh, only as well. When we have that, uh, we make a hole in uh, another layer and we put our flower uh, through the hole. Just uh, do it gently and um, we'll be sticking the petals uh, in the gaps so try not to overlap with the previous layer and I add glue in the middle of the previous uh, layer and stick each petal separately. When we have uh, that, we add another layer. This is the third one. As you can see, I um, stretched the petals a little bit more. 
and we uh, do the same we did the last time just add a glue in the middle and secure the petals fourth layer will be a little bit different because we uh, here add a glue uh, lower on the flower not not in the middle but we still want to um, uh, add we, we still want to stick those um, petals on because they will not keep um, the shape if you just stick it on the bottom it will be loose and um, just you know not looking really nice last layer we only stick on the bottom and uh, actually our flower is um, is almost finished it's just what I did here I pushed those top um, petals like inside and the bottom a little bit outside and I'm also going to add a lovely touch to my flowers and I be painting them with a glitter paint from 13 Arts it's a silver um, paint and it gives nice um, shimmer I hope you like the flowers and if you do please like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel thank you very much for watching have a lovely day bye